Happy New Year. Happy 2024. The year that started with basketballs from Nollywood celebrity actor Yo Edoche. So today we are going to be discussing the genesis of Yo Edoche's family saga. <laughs> Look, a lot we're going to touch down on everything we'll be discussing. May Edoche, Yo Edoche, Judy Austin, Sarah Martin, Sarpet Edoche, his father, his Yo Edoche's mother, Yo Edoche's auntie, May Edoche's parents, so much more. And also we will talk about what you just did few minutes ago. In order for you to understand fully, you have to take your time and watch this video through to the end. Enjoy every bit of it because you brought the drama online and we are just here to analyze and dissect that being said welcome back entertainment daily lovers and i am your host octavia cora here we give you the critical analysis about celebrity gists hot topics and we also deep dive we do a deep dive on youtubers gist also anyway that being said let's get right into this nollywood celebrity gist and this saga this basketball that's been going on but if you're enjoying gist like this don't forget to subscribe and also turn on notification bell let's get right into this gist okay so like i said there's a lot that we are going to be discussing on this so we're talking about the genesis the root of this whole thing where did this thing start from and that's what we're going to be discussing. Now, this whole thing started many, many years ago, to be precise, 17, 18 years ago. When Yul Edoche was still very young and May also was still very young. Before these two even knew what life was about, Yul Edoche's father, Sarpet Edoche, and May Edoche's father, that I do not know his name. So, these two were close friends. So that simply means May Edoche's family and Yul Edoche's family are friends. They are family friends. They've been family friends even before these two knew anything about boyfriend and girlfriend or whatnot. And these two family look like family that are upright. Now I said look like because we're working with what we've seen online. We do not know any one of them personally. Okay, we do not know any of them personally. So this whole thing started then because these two were friends somehow, somehow, I believe you, Ledoche, and his family will go visiting uh, May Edoche and May Edoche uh, also and her father, mother, family will also go visiting. And I guess that's how they first saw each other and that's how they first knew who they were. Somehow, somehow, something happened and there was an entanglement between Yul Edoche and May Edoche. Now we're talking about the young Yul Edoche and the very young May Edoche when they were still maybe in their teens. And as you know, teenagers do not know much about protecting themselves and doing whatnot somewhere along the line they got pregnant with their first child named daniela that is now a big beautiful grown woman that is in the university rocking life she is also a youtuber creating content here on youtube they got pregnant with their very first fruit and i believe that took the family that took both families by storm like they were shocked they were perplexed at what they were seeing and because they were upright family that did not want to embarrass themselves they had to put this join these two together not thinking of what might happen in the future what might happen later because now they are still young their body is telling them to do this do that but they will grow up and they might grow out of love somebody would outgrow the other one people's uh, lifestyle and everything will change they might not be good together but because the family wanted to protect their family name from both sides they decided to pair these two together and knowing one thing about the african culture and the nigerians you can hardly say no to your parents many years ago it's of recent that kids are being bold enough to say, if the parents say, do this, you say, no, look, up to what you study in a university level, in most cases are decided by the parents. They tell you, you will be a doctor, you will be an engineer, you will be an accountant, you will be a lawyer, you will be 
whatever they say, that's what you're going to do. And there are certain professions that you cannot even dare think about. One, being a footballer. Two, being a musician. Three, being an artist. You know, like, well, no, these are mm -mm, for unserious people. Okay? So there was nothing these two could have done to change anything. They got together, had Daniela. They couldn't have gone against their parents' wish. So they stayed together. Even though over the years, they are beginning to come into their real personality. Now they are maybe in their 20s, early 20s, mid 20s to late 20s. They are beginning to discover, look, this guy is quite, mm, this girl is you know, they, they're beginning to see their true colors and seeing that all is not well. But because of the respect that they have for their family, they will still hold on. And they had four more kids. They had three more kids together. Fast forward many years later, I feel like you had that in mind. But because May looks like someone that no matter how upset or whatever, she would handle it in a quite different way. Yule Doche by himself has already referred to himself as a coconut head. And most times when someone is called a coconut head, it simply means that person is very stubborn. The person hardly listens to anyone. He has said he has always been a rascal. These are his words. So Yule being the rascal and the coconut head using his own words that he is, he knew that he was going to do something. He knew that he was going to get out there. And because Yul admire his father a lot, he wanted to take in his father's footstep. He decided to go into the industry. And you know, if you're getting into Nollywood, Hollywood, Bollywood, Gollywood, whatever hood, you know that you're going to be meeting a lot of the opposite sex. And you're going to be playing scenes where we people are going to be cuddling, kissing, hugging, smooshing, and all of that. Having all of these women and all of that available to you at Dolce from school days to when he started acting and all of that, these things got into you at Dolce's head and you felt like I can do and I can undo. I can do whatever I want. I can play. Now, many years later, you at Dolce and me at Dolce, they were building their family together, even though I believe as at this point, they've already been seeing the signs that they are not compatible, but they were willing to hold it down, not because of their sake, but because of the sake of their family, because of the sake of their parents. They're holding down their relationship because of the sake of their parents. Now, you being the kind of person that he is, he knows fully well that he was going to pay his parents back, his family back in their own coin. Now, remember, Yul is one of the youngest in his family. I don't know what position May holds in her family. Now, May is very private. That's why we don't know so much about her. We don't know her family name. We don't know her parents. I've not seen photo of her parents. We don't know what they look like because she's that private. Yul Edoche, the Edoches are very popular because of Sir Pet Edoche. He has been an actor even before Nollywood ever existed. Okay, so that's why we know so much about the Edoches and not so much about May's side of the family. So those of you that might be wondering, why are you mentioning Edoches but you're not mentioning May, May's uh, family? We do not know what their family name is. And if you do, drop it as a comment. Now, with all these cracks in their relationship, they were still holding it down because of the sake of their parents. But Yul was out there doing what he was doing. This is where we bring in Mrs. Obasi, which is now Mrs. Yul Edoche. That is Judy Austin. Judy Austin, in her own world also, was a young lady that got married to a man that she was never in love with, but probably because the man was able to take care of her because she's not from a wealthy family or a well-to-do, let's not even say wealthy, a well-to-do family, she had to go with whatever was available as at then, but because she she had big dreams and she was she had plans to pursue those dreams, she decided she was going to go with this man. The man, Mr. Obasi, married her and promised to send her to school. 
That's where her path and you, Ledoche's path crossed. Now, remember, I told you Sarpet Edoche, who is you, Ledoche's father, has been in the industry for a very long time, even before Nollywood got the name Nollywood. Well respected man in Nigeria, in the whole of Nigeria. When you mention Sarpet Edoche, people respect him, people bow down to greet him. He's, he's, he, 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 you know, he, he, gets, he gets that respect whenever he's seen outside. So she already knows who he is and seeing that this is the son of Sarpet Edoche, or should I say chief Sarpet Edoche. Judy Austin knew that she was not going to let this pass her by. She was going to use that as a ticket into the industry. Well, then it wasn't even Nollywood, right? But she knew she was going to use that as a ticket to get into her acting career. Because one thing you know, it is not easy. It is not okay right now. It's a little bit more easier getting into the industry than it was many years ago. Mostly then it was someone knowing someone, a, a parent introducing their first, you know, so that you must know someone in order to get in. So she was going to stick to Yul Edoche and she was going to do whatever Yul Edoche wanted. She was going to act like a fool just to achieve that dream that she had in mind. And that is how she became friends with him, became close to him. And every 50 shade of gray idea that was in you, Ledoche's head, Judy Austin was willing to fulfill. On the other hand, May was on the front line holding down the family not bothering to pay so much attention to whatever her husband was doing. So whatever was going on, May did not know. Even if she was suspecting that her husband was probably stepping out on her, she never had a proof. She never caught him red-handed. So she didn't have anything. And I believe whenever she would have confronted him, you would deny it hands down. And because May Edoche was based in Lagos, which is the West, and you, Ledoche, was working mostly in the east. So that's many hours trip. If you're traveling by road, except you're taking a flight from Lagos and landing in one of the major and then taking maybe one hour, two hours drive. But, but if you're going by road, which most people go by road, it is many hours drive from Lagos down to Onicha, Enugu, Asaba, and all of that. Now, when all of this was happening, Yul already knew that he had fallen out of love with May Edoche. And I believe May would have seen the signs that there is changes in her husband. But one thing I think May did not expect or did not see coming is that Yul would fall in love with someone else. She must have been suspecting that he is acting weird. Something is going on with him, but she did not see all of this whole full-blown relationship coming side talks we can argue that she had or maybe she didn't because words on the street is that may knew that something was going on but some other persons are saying may did not know about anything but well judy austin being the kind of person that she is knowing that she has big dreams and those goals she was going to make sure that she crushed all her goals no matter who or what is on her way if you're on her way she will crush you alongside as she's going to make sure that she achieves all her goals this lady was able to use her first husband to graduate from school we're talking about the university or polytechnic that she attended and after graduation she knew that she was going to be clinging to you, Ledoche, like leech. Like if you've been in, a, in the water and those leech, the way they, 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 they just leech onto you and they, they start sucking your blood. You know, sometimes in Nigeria, they call them sucking blood. That's exactly who Judy Austin is. Now, Judy Austin knew that she was building and working her way into you, Ledoche's heart because she was doing virtually everything but remember you Ledoche was hooked up with May from when he was young so he has not even done all those things that his friends will be talking about all those nine south and all those crazy stuff 50 shades of gray stuff that they are doing enjoying life you was just there being a husband walking and all of that trying to respect his family and try to respect May Edoche's family also so he was not really enjoying life the way a single man would in his age because he got married 
pretty early, which would have upset him so much because he would have known people that would have gotten rid of pregnancies. He would have known people that got, somebody got pregnant and they're like, okay, put to bed and we're going to take the baby, but we're not going to marry that lady. And he cannot understand why in his own case, it has to be different. So know that all of this has been building up in you, Ledoche's heart, for so long. Now, fast forward to when this whole news now broke online that you, Ledoche, is having an affair with someone. The lady broke by Gist Lover blog, actually. And then you, Ledoche, now came out and that he has, had a, he has a child out of wedlock and all of that. Then... Yule came out, immediately that news came out. That was when Yule now came out and said, yes, the story is true, that he took a second wife. He did not make it look like he has done something wrong. Because for you, Ledoche, this is an opportunity to pay the people that forced him into a marriage that he was not ready for just because he got a young lady pregnant. So for him, now I am going to find a woman that I really love. I am going to find a woman now that I'm matured enough and I understand and I know what I want in life. And I can see that this lady, May Edoche, is not my type. We really don't have so much in common for us to be husband and wife like that. So I'm going to do what I'm going to do. And if my actions is going to bring embarrassment to my family and her family, I do not give a hoot. Judy Austin by this time has already divorced the man that she was married to because she knew that you Ledoche was a better fish because he was the son. This was not even about money. This was about the connections. This was about the link. Okay, this was about the bridge. That's what it was. Not about the money because if it was about the money, you is not even one of the richest actors in Nollywood, if we would look at it that way. So why you? Because you, Ledoche, is from a family that is well respected. And she being someone from the East also, it will make sense that she will go that route to someone that is respected, uh, someone that is respected in the East by the Igbos and someone that is respected in Ninja and outside Nigeria, in other African country around the globe. So when this lady saw all of this, Judy Austin last on to Yule was willing to stroke up until now. She will stroke his ego and his ego is now so mighty that he can actually consume a whole community. He can consume a whole village. That is how egoistic he is. That's how proud he is. He doesn't see anything. He will declare himself the most handsome man in Nigeria. He will declare himself the, the man with the best voice in the whole world. The man with the best voice in Nollywood. He will say that all his uh, fellow actors and actresses are jealous of him because he's got the voice. He's got the this. He's got the that. Yule is so proud and Judy has been behind him giving him this false narrative, giving him this, this false picture of himself. So why not? Do what you got to do. Be reckless. Don't use protection because she knew what she wanted to achieve and immediately she got pregnant. There was nothing you was going to say to Judy that was going to get Judy to get rid of that pregnancy. There was nothing you would do that would make Judy not to be his second wife. Because now she's now a producer. She's seen in more movies. He's directing her movies. They're producing together. They are working together. They're doing so much together. She's, people are beginning to know her more. Because when you, Ledoche, is in a poster in a Nollywood movie, a whole lot of people want to watch. Because one thing you cannot take away from you, Ledoche, he might have bad character. But you, Ledoche, is a good actor and knows how to interpret a script. So this was a ticket. This was... Honey, this was sugar. This was just too good to let go. And Judy Austin stuck to it. May, being the type that is a family oriented, family, family, everything, trying to build their family, build their wealth, looking into their businesses, seeing how their home, they will build. Just, just 
keeping that family, that woman that would hold her family down, was busy holding what she thought was a family, not knowing that Yule was already done with her. He was no longer attracted to her that way. He no longer see her that way because he's now on a different level where Judy Austin and the other people he's been having escapade with have been giving him 50 shades of gray. Meanwhile, when he comes back home, Judy, um, May Edoche will be praying with, uh, what they call it, the, the Holy Rosary, you know, and the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. And that was not what Yule was all about at this point in his life. So Yule felt no type of way because he had long fallen out of love with May Edoche. So when he came out, he posted all of this. Internet started dragging him. Instead of you, Ledoche, to calm down, allow the whole thing to die down, apologize, and even if he wanted a divorce, get a divorce, but he, he was just beating his chest. He has two wives. He's this, he's that, because the second wife was there stroking his egos. Now, that didn't end there. Judy Austin, the second wife, was out there. She has not even entered the home already. She was ready to compete with the first wife, May Edoche. Now, I said, first, of course, Judy Austin is ready to be numbered. May Edoche said she would not be numbered. So, of course, in Judy Austin's eyes, she is a second wife and she is ready to overtake because overtaking is allowed. It doesn't matter the situation in Judy Austin's mind. Judy Austin recruited her own friend, Sarah Martins, and they started the Pepe Dem gang, where Sarah Martins was busy dragging May Edoche right, left, center, and people could not even understand why these women were doing these things. But sometimes you will plan something that you feel like you've planned it very well, but it backfired. Fast forward many months later, when she started getting death threats, she did a U-turn, apologized to May online, and now she is singing a new song where she was seen on Daddy Freeze's live stream, calling out Judy Austin for owing her 1 million naira and refusing to pay, asking for her 50,000 naira that she gave to Judy Austin, Judy Austin refused to pay. She talked about the endorsement that Judy Austin wanted to have because May Edoche was having brand deals up until this minute that I'm speaking to you. When you pull up May Edoche's Instagram, it is filled up with different endorsements deals judy austin according to her best friend allegedly according to sarah martins judy austin told her look you have to give me this one million let's do this brand deal so other brands will see me and want to work with me because it is not only may edoche that will be cashing out now fast forward to the end of the year you wrote that 2023 was his best year and people online could not understand why this man that lost his son in 2023 that's the second child he had with may edoche these are the kids he had when he was very young that child was 16 years old his, that was his first son the boy went to school wrote his exams went to play football Said he was tired, wanted to re relax, collapse. That's how that boy didn't make it back home. Died. His wife, May Edoche, left social media for so long. Everybody was touched. Everybody was pained. So when everybody saw this post coming that 2023 was his best year, people could not understand. Fast forward two days. I think he did his own post either on the 29th or so. Two days later... May Edoche, either, two, either he did on the 29th or 30th. So by 31st, May Edoche posted her own saying how 2023 dealt with her. And we did, with a lot of people reacted to that. I also reacted to that video where we talked about how you, Edoche's post did not make much sense. But May did not say anything to him. But you, Edoche came out immediately. May Edoche posted this and started with very insultive, very degrading, you know, shameful type of post talking about how she did uh, uh, breast enlargement, how May did Tommy Talk, and it was sponsored by her married boyfriend. And 
He continued by saying if she had passed on, everybody would have blamed him, not knowing that he was not aware. He then went further to talk about the fact that he has um, uh, been asking for his bride price, but May and her family has refused. Now, this brings me to what I said in the beginning. I said, we're going to talk about you, Edoche's family. We're going to talk about May Edoche's family. We're going to touch down on every part. I told you guys that when that thing happened many years ago, you had that stuff in mind and knew that he was going to pay his family and her family back with their own coin. And this is the time to embarrass them and you is cashing out with it and being backed up by a woman that has no conscience, his second wife. And why did I say so? When you let Doche's first son died, this woman came out posting a video, dancing and singing and talking about how much God loves her. She had just had their second child, I think, that period. And she was talking about how God loves her, arrows that were supposed to be, arrows that were sent to her, things that they sent to her to destroy her, went back to send her. Everything she was saying was just insinuating that it seemed like May Edoche tried to unleave her. And instead, May Edoche ended up unleaving her own flesh and blood. And you, Edoche, did not see anything wrong with this. Hence, people are feeling like this guy is under a spell. But do I think you, Ledoche, is under a spell? No, I don't. What I think is happening here is obsession. Yule is 110% obsessed with Judy Austin because I think this is the first time in his life that he is, he is meeting a woman that is this Raz. This is the first time he's meeting a woman that has all 50 shades of gray and is ready to go there with you, okay? Ready to go to hell and back with you. And this is the first time. Someone that will not say, ah, let's not do this. Someone that does not have that moral uh, a compass to say oh this is not right this is mm -mm. she's ready to do anything as far as she's going to get a goal and that has been confirmed by her friend when her friend said she wanted to pay you le doce for an endorse for to pay you le doce to promote her brand when you le doce did not do it her friend i mean sarah martins when you le doce did not do what he was supposed to do because he was asking for too much money and she said she does not have a million naira for just to make one minute video and to and all of that so he said okay a hundred thousand for just a copy and paste of your own video and a hundred thousand for facebook and a hundred thousand for you for youtube sorry a hundred thousand for facebook and a hundred thousand for instagram but he still didn't do that and she called judy austin instead of judy austin to say ah i will speak to him yada 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 no judy austin said why would you you have that type of money to pay to him why didn't you pay it to me so i can promote it for you already you can see that judy austin is in competition with this man you will know that what is happening between these two is not love but because yule is so blinded by everything that judy austin has first of all giant chest giant behind you know everything massive he has a lot to enjoy the 50 shade of gray you, the, the rasness the, the the way she strokes his ego that has made you ledoche to not understand that this woman is not here for you for the long time she is here for short time and once she gets everything that she needs once she gets that popularity which she has already gotten to an extent but she knows that it is still not enough once she starts making the type of money that yule is making in endorsement once she starts getting a lot of brands working with her once she has fixed a place for herself in the nollywood industry she is going to dump yule edoche like a dirty old rag but then it will be too late because right now he has hurt so many people, his own family. Let's forget about friends and anything else, but his own family. We're talking about Ina Kakul's people. Embarrassed the hell out of his father, his mother, his family, Me Edoche's family and friends and everybody around him. In fact, even the whole nation is embarrassed by you, Edoche's recent behavior. Calling out this woman and some persons are even saying that these posts might not even be coming from you, Ledoche, but from the second wife, Judy Austin, which is what 
Rita Edoche, and that brings his auntie. Like I said, we'll also talk about Rita Edoche, which is the auntie. And she has been vocal from the beginning of this whole thing. Her own point of view is that all of those posts are being typed by Judy Austin, being posted by Judy Austin. So she is not going to drag you, Edoche, but she is going to drag Judy Austin. But even if that is the case, where I beg to differ is the fact that even if you give someone access to your account, you still have full access to your own account. So whatever is being posted from your account, in few minutes, you will also see it because you have your device with you and you will be able to delete it. But you did not do that. You posted the first one, all the blogs carried it and you went ahead. Few hours later, he posted continuation and then today you posted two more where he was talking about drop my name and before he even talked about this drop my name you filed for divorce drop my name and yada 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 a celebrity's wife yomi casual's wife actually wrote something like that on may's post saying why not drop this name find your own self build your own brand and a lot of other people supported some other persons were like don't give her the such advice but look well in my own opinion, what May can do is just to remove the name Yule and instead of having her name as May Yule Edoche, she can have her name as May Edoche because the family still loves her and there is nothing you can do about that. But to fast forward to this evening, like I said, Yule Edoche have deleted everything and I think it's too late.